Welcome to O.M. James. I am O.M. James. And today, today, today is Wednesday, Wednesday, formerly known as Wednesday. And it's fitting today because we are playing some NES game. This is a game I haven't played yet on the channel. It's a game I love. I've played it for many years. Good, really good two-player simultaneous play game. But today we're playing single player, as you know. But I hope you guys enjoy it. I really do enjoy it. Let's just go ahead and jump right into it, too. By the way, I was going to play a different game today, but I can't figure out how to play it in windowed mode in order to get my capture set up correctly. So I got a legitimate copy of World of Coaster Tycoon 2 that I love, and I want to play it, but I can't, specifically because I can't figure out how to run it in windowed mode, and I can't get OBS to capture it in full screen mode. So I got to figure something out. I'll get back to you on that one. In the meantime, let's play some... Chippendale, rescue me. Okay, gang, we have a new assignment. Our cute little neighbor, Mandy, has lost her kitten. This is Gadget talking, by the way. She's the cute little mouse. I say this is a job for the Rescue Rangers. And watch, it is. <clears throat> oh, is that not Gadget? No, now it says Gadget. I think that, I didn't even see who was talking, actually. I didn't realize it has their name right about there. It shows their name. I'll go on ahead, Chip, and scatter some things in mind that might help while we search the city. Chip, good idea, Gadget. That's the spirit. Dale, you and I can start on the trail. Monty, why don't you and Zipper track down one of those strange mechanical dogs we've been seeing? Suddenly so talking so slowly. Why is it one line at a time? That's not very effi efficient. In the park lately. Me mechanical dogs? Oh, piece of cake, Chip. We'll get right on it. I'm not doing an accent for him. You can depend on us. All right, here we go. This is the game. It's really simple. It's a platformer. Are you surprised? See, I can't jump aside now that I got an apple on me. Oh, ugh, ugh. Oh, I don't need it. Get rid of the apple. Okay, so you use those items there. You throw them at bad guys. You have a little bit of control over it. You collect these little, uh... I don't remember what they do. But you get these, uh, little flower thingies. Little flower... There you go. See, that guy's easy. See, I took him out. There's a star there, too. It has to do with points, or you get... If you get enough of them, you get an extra life or something. I don't remember, really. There's the jump. Oh, he's gonna come up here and get me. Oh, I got him with that. Oh, you can go down like this. Watch. Boop, and there he goes, too. So you can also use it defensively. It's kind of nice. <clears throat> You'll see, too, that you can pick up boxes that aren't the one on top. So I could pick up, like, this box. I remember when I was younger and I used to play this game that I tried to always make sure I had a fresh box on me. Like, I wouldn't... If I already had one for a while, like, for a good couple of minutes, I'd go and I'd get a fresh one. Ah! Oh, not supposed to hit that. Okay, jump over. There we go. Oh, no, I'm gonna die. Uh, where are you going? You gone? Okay, cool. That guy's gone. I got this guy right here. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Boom, right in the face. Like it, like it. Okay, there you go. And you saw too right there that even though it was one space above me, I was still able to grab that piece. So we're doing pretty good so far. I got hit a couple times. Not happy about it. I think actually I got hit once. Once or twice. I think you start off at three, so I think I got hit once. Take him out too. This first level isn't too tough. Here's Zipper. He's gonna fly around, and take care of all the bad guys for me. I just gotta keep running. I'm completely invincible. That's right. So just keep on running. Let him take care of as many of these guys as I can. He's gone. So now I've got to take care of myself. I'm back to taking care of my own chip cell. <clears throat> you know, when I was young... Oh, I just died. That's not the way you do it. See, I'm all the way back, to get, all the way back at the beginning. Okay, you know, this time I'm just going to run through. All these little flowers and stars are nifty-grifty, but I need to go and get something done. Hold on one second. got to adjust something. There we go. Now I'm good. I'm good. Okay, ignore you. I'm a platformer. I can take care of this without even touching them. I not get hit by that this time. No, I don't care about the star this time either. Jump over him. Get rid of all that. I can grab those if they're in my way, but that's about it. <clears throat> I'm not going to fall down that same spot if I fall down that same spot. Hope you guys are having a great Wednesday. It's the hump day, so the week is about halfway through. It's pretty nice. Always nice when you get to the weekend again. If you're into that sort of thing. I am. I like weekends. I think most people probably are, but some people, the weekend means nothing to them, because they work on the weekend. I do not work on the weekend, so for me, the weekend is awesome. Okay, now this thing, we go down. There you go. This thing is reusable. You see that? Go down again. Boop. Now, make sure he he's going to come back. Okay, I got to try to grab this that I'm coming back. Okay, there you go. I got it. This thing does not weigh me down, even though it's like a big hunk of metal. But the nice thing is there, every time you see a bad guy, you just duck down, and you're good. You're good. I don't think it goes very far, though, either. Let me try it. Yeah, see, it just goes down. It's heavy. Uh oh no, I can't. Uh-oh. Hold on. Okay, there you go. I'm good. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, dude. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna try to beat at least the first level here. Come on now. I'm only going for like five minutes. I can play for a while. Wow, he disappeared. Did you see that? He went right off the screen. He was gone. Okay, apparently that helps with the bees. Good, because bee... Oh, I got hit. I did not want to get hit. No, oh, I got hit twice. Okay, hopefully... Okay, good. I don't know if I was the boss yet. There's a boss battle coming up here pretty quick. I uh, don't remember the first boss. It has something to do with different colored balls. 
like, I think, I don't remember, I'll just show you guys. So, I can only throw straight, I'm kind of trying to refresh my memory at the same time, but look at these decent little graphics though, it's like a whole little tiny world. Specifically, see this puzzle right here? But it's a little tiny world because you're playing as a chipmunk who's tiny, you know. Oh, I did not mean to do that, and I died. Don't start at the very beginning. Okay. I already hit the checkpoint. I think that's what that door was, was my checkpoint. So just skip all this, skip all this. I gotta learn, I gotta play, think like a speedrunner. By the way, you guys hear about that guy who did the fastest ever record on Super Mario Bros. now? I mean, given it was only by, like, fractions of a second, but still. He done beat the Super Mario Bros. faster, like Guinness Book World Records faster. He beat it! <clears throat> Nobody can compete it! It was nice. It was cool. It was, like, it was cool to see it, like, being talked about on the news, you know? Okay, that's, is this the bad guy? Cheese. Oh, Monty. That was just an excuse to get Monty in the game. All he did is he went on- Okay, here's the ball I was talking about. I remember this now. Well, watch out for that. You only get hit three times. You gotta- Jump! Dude. I just got hit three times and I'm dead. Game over. Gah! Look at that. Did you see that? Oh my- ah. Do it again. Hey, that's the life of a NES player. These games are not that easy. The NES was known notoriously for its difficult games. And it's true. And this game isn't even that tough. I just- it's brutal, though. It does not forgive you. It does not give you a lot of chances. You do get continues. That was nice. I'm glad that I immediately was able to continue. Of course, by continuing, I start at the very beginning of the level, so... Later on, especially, continuing gets more valuable, because you actually... ...are continuing in harder parts of the game. Boop, 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 boop. We're just gonna try to race. I'm gonna do that speedrun thing. That's not the way to do it. I'm gonna try to do the speedrun thing again, just get all the way to the end and beat that boss without dying. I've beaten this game! I've gotten all the way to, to Fat Cat at the very end. It's happened. So I know I can do it. I got it in me. S ignore all this. Just in case he jumped. I don't think he jumps like that, but just in case. Oh, shoot. Give me that. There you go. Got it again. Watch out for the sparky spark. Don't want to die, e die. That was lame. Keep going. I'm trying to ignore all this. I'm going to hit by the bee. I'm going to get by the bee. Oh, I'm going to hit by the bee. And the. Dag nabbit. Brutal, y'all. I really was hoping to show you guys me beating that first bad guy, the first boss. It hasn't happened yet. But I'm working. I'm gonna try one last time. It's my last time, guys. I can only take so much going doing the exact same level. And I really... God, I'm already getting loose on it. See, I'm getting frustrated. You can't do that. You gotta keep your focus. Now, that's a part of it, too. When you're playing a game that's tough like this, you can't give up easy. You'll never, ever be able to see the game. That People put a lot of effort into this game. It's really fun. The later levels, they get to be even more fun. You start feeling good about yourself because you're taking out all the bad guys and you're not dying when everybody else is dying. Like, it's cool. It's really rewarding. Just the big caveat is you have to actually be able to survive it, which I'm trying to do right now. What you guys got planned for the weekend, huh? Can't answer that, but think about it. It's good to have be mindful about that. Know what you got planned for the weekend. Let me at least get... I got one hit point. I got those bees coming up, and they're tough, man. They're gonna make... Oh, man. I can't do it! I can't do it! Ah, oh, okay. I said one more time, but I, I'll get to the next- if I have to continue. When I get to the continue again, I will not continue this time. Sorry. I- I'm sorry, guys. I'm in it. If I was playing live, you know, if I play one of these games live sometime, I tell you what, I will stick with it for a good, like, at least four, half, 45 minutes, an hour. Really give it a good shot. Maybe I'll hit this again up. Maybe this is my- my clue that I need to play this game live for you guys, so you can really see me suffer in real time. Boop, got that. Just muscle memory at this point. Just keep running, keep running. That's the fastest thing you can do is just keep running. Keep running, man. And, oh, almost. You see that? I almost got him there. There's also a state you get into when you play a game, especially when you play the same level over and over again. It's kind of like a, a state of zen, you know, where you really are just sort of zoning out. He's gonna come back. Okay, good. I've done it before where I'm almost zoning out. And actually, it makes it easier to do commentary, you know, even, that you almost zone out and then you end up doing better at the game than you ever have. Like, I got past that part I can never get past, and I wasn't even paying attention. Some people I've, I've heard, you know, they'll go driving somewhere, they'll get to their destination and not remotely remember how they got there, because they just weren't paying attention. You see those quick reflexes? There's gonna be a B in a second. Whoa, dude. Okay, we're doing a lot better this time. I should just keep talking about it, you know what? Maybe that's my ticket, isn't it? I uh, see, as soon as I stop talking about it. Boom, I predicted that guy. I knew he was coming. It's like when you play Clash Royale and you throw that log just as you throw the goblin barrel. That's kind of what it was like. Oh, got him too. Look at that. I'm getting everybody. Everybody. I can get all the way to the boss. Yeah, no problem, dude. I got this. Eat that. Oh, I forgot you can throw up like that. <clears throat> throw up like... No, I'm just kidding. 
Here's again the cutscene that's pretty much useless. Okay, now I got all the way here again. Boom, boom. I gotta watch out for those things. Don't get dizzy. Don't get dizzy. It's very important that I don't get dizzy. Just keep moving. Up, down. Are you kidding me? I forgot. I can't even touch the hands. One more time. I'm gonna do it one more time. I can't give up. My gosh, I get tired of it, but I can do it. I'm capable. I'm a strong human being. I have willpower. I can decide to go on. And I am. I have one final continue and I'm using it. Keep it going. Keep it going. Up and at him. Up and at him. Skip all this. See, I realize I'm mean, my real goal right... I knew I was going to hit him too. My real goal right now is just to get to the end. If I can even just get to that halfway point, then I can die once or twice. I don't know how many lives. I think I get two lives, three lives, something like that. But I could die a couple times and still be okay. So if I can at least get to that... <clears throat> the waypoint. The, the kind of quick save point. I can't get that guy. I get close, but it doesn't work. So I'm going to grab this. I'm going to predict it again. Predict it again. Boom. Gone. Got it. I, start, I got hit one time, but I think I'll be alright. I'm going to grab this too, because I realize it's good to be prepared. I even knew that when I played this when I was younger. It was always be prepared for stuff, man. I got to grab this guy too, for the same exact reason. Be prepared. I see bad guy. Boom. Gone. Keep on moving. I did not mean to fall down here. I don't want to die, please. Okay. Here we go. Hit him! Hit him if you got him, and I did get him, and I hit him. Okay, so that bee's coming up real soon. You ready for it? First, it's this guy who jumps off the screen. There he goes again. Look at that. That's so funny. But, oh, I got the bee. I didn't know I could get the bee. Okay, there's going to be this guy here. Boom. Hey, look at that. Twice in a row I got no bee on that screen. Maybe because I took him out. First time I didn't take him out, though. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Oh, I'm scared he's going to jump up and hit me. Hit him. Thank you. See, I don't mind if I hit you. Just don't hit me. I think it's fair. You know? I am the protagonist here. I'm the one with the controller in my hand. Controller in my hand, not playing, controlling very well. Boom, got him too. Keep going. I gotta try to get to that boss again without getting hit. And just take him out. I'm starting to kind of remember, oh, go, go. Starting to kind of remember the um, timing of it too. You grab the ball. The first hit's kind of for free, watch. Free hit, boom, boom. Then you gotta ignore these for a second. I can't hit those, I just did it again. You gotta ignore the hand. You can't hit the hand. Maybe if I stay on this side, it's a little easier. The hand's not right in my face. Look at that. I got a nice routine going. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no, don't. Keep running. Keep running. Oh, I got my timing off. Got him. We got him. Okay. That's how you beat the first world. Zone zero. Clear. Get ready. Go. Let's see if I get some bonuses here. Bonus? No. Bonus? No. Bonus? No. Stinky bonuses. Okay. Fat cat. Ha ha ha. I tricked you, rescue rangers. The kitten was just a clever trap to lure you here. I've already caught your precious gadget. <laughs> from now on, she's inventing things for me. You'll have to take her from my casino if you really want her back. Ba boom. A or B, guys. A or B. A or B. You can't tell me, but I'm a guess. Let's go for A. Boom. And here we go. Pausing it right there. We are going to save our game. Make sure I, I save it. Where is it? Do we do? Do we do? Do we do? Save state. Quick save state. We'll do quick save state one. Yeah, we'll do that. That'll work. Okay, guys, hope you guys enjoyed that. <clears throat> I really did enjoy the trip down memory lane, and I'm glad that we learned a valuable lesson today, guys. OM Jamers, and that is you don't give up, even when the going gets tough. You stick with it, because you are capable, fully capable human beings who are able to do it if you just keep pressing forward like I did earlier today. So that was awesome. Enjoying sharing that experience with you of not giving up, biting the bullet, learning the routine, getting the timing down, having one hit point left, and still beating the boss. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I did too. And again, hope you guys enjoyed your Wednesdays. Continue to do your Wednesdays. Yada, yada, yada. You know, basically, I'm just stalling to get to the good stuff, which is, as always, OM Jamers, make somebody smile today, guys. Yeah. Dig it. Good stuff, man. That's good. Good stuff. Fun stuff. Thanks for joining me.